Hi friends, got another product delivered today. It's a new translator device. Now it's made by the same company that I did a review for the Time Kettle translator earbuds a year ago last summer. And uh, when the same company, Time Kettle, contacted me and said, would you like to try our newest translator device, I was real quick to say yes, because I already know how accurate the translations are. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Fluent Talk by Time Kettle. See what it says about it. It does voice translation, does offline translation, photo translation, take a picture of text and it'll translate it, a built-in data card, the T1 mini translator device, translation with one button, one year unlimited global data provided, up to 95% accuracy, Offline access. Hey, let's see what we got in the box. Now, full disclosure, it's not in the box. <laughs> I got so excited to see it in person, I took it out of the box already. You know, I used to have a guy that went with me if I needed to go to a doctor and the translation between my English and my Spanglish needed to be really, really good to explain why I was at the doctor. If I'm going to a government office where they always re refuse to speak uh, anything other than Spanish, I had a guy that I took with me. Well, my new guy is in my pocket. The whole guy is right there in my pocket. <laughs> Fluent talk. You know, my old guy, he spoke English and Spanish. My new guy, this guy, 36 languages and 88 local dialects. Ah, what's in the box? We got uh, an owner's manual. First several pages are in English. Step one, turn it on. Step two, press the button. Step three, translate. What's this is a lanyard. Hook it on the translator, put it around your neck, it even stretches out. You need to put it to the other person to talk to it. And in here is a charging cable and a data transfer cable. USB-C, the newest stuff everybody's going to. I'm going to uh, charge it up and find somebody to talk to in something other than English. Well, I have to tell you that when they first asked me to take a look at this new translator, my first reaction was, well, I've already got an iPhone 13. It does that. Google Translate does it. Why would I need something else? Well... Let's take a look at how this works. Well, you can see the relative sizes of the two devices. iPhone 13, Fluent Talk T1 Mini. Now, if I want to translate, first of all, I got to find the app. That's Google Translate. And if I've had something before I've translated, I have to clear it. But let's say I want to do some text. Well, I got to hit this, and then I got to hit that button in order to take a picture of the text, and then I have to hit that button, and then it'll give me the thing. Let's not do that right now because I can't pick up the phone. Got a camera in the other hand. So we're going to translate by voice instead of typing. And uh, the first thing I want to do is check and make sure that I've got English to Spanish and not Spanish to English. So the first thing I have to do is press the button and then I can talk and translate something and then press the button again. And then if I want the other person to hear it, I have to press this little microphone here. Presiona el botón y luego puedo hablar y traducir algo. And then if they want to talk, 
I got to go back to home. I got to change from English to Spanish to Spanish to English. Como esta, amigo? Press it again. Press that again. How are again. you, friend? How are you, friend? You mean, how are you, friend? <laughs> okay, so, now, let's do the same process with the translator. Fluent Talk translator. iPhone 13, Time Kettle T1 Mini. Fits in my hand pretty good. Fits in my hand perfectly. What time is it? ¿Qué hora son? What time are we going to dinner? ¿A qué hora vamos a cenar? ¿Qué hora es ahorita? What time is it now? ¿Cuándo? When. When. ¿Cuándo? This is so much easier than Google Translate on my iPhone 13. Este es tu entonces traductor de Google en mi iPhone 13. One. I have new technology that will help us communicate. Will you help me demonstrate it for YouTube? Tengo nueva tecnología que nos ayudará a comunicarnos. ¿Me ayudarás a demostrarlo para YouTube? Sí. Yes. So, we just need to have a little conversation. Tell me again, like you were the, earlier today, and I didn't understand it completely. What are you using my yellow saw for that you borrowed? Así que solo necesitamos tener una pequeña conversación. Cuéntame de nuevo, como si estuvieras hoy temprano y no lo entendí del todo. ¿Para qué estás usando mi sierra amarilla que te prestaste? Para cortar tubos viejos. Y meter nuevos. To cut old pipes and put new ones in. Are you working at your house or at your mother's house? Where? ¿Estás trabajando en tu casa o en la casa de tu madre? No, en, en, en la casa de mi madre. Mi casa, no, mi no tengo casa. So in my mother's house, my house, no, I don't have a home. So, how long have you been doing concrete? Not for me, but for a long time. You've been doing concrete. How long? Entonces, ¿cuánto tiempo llevas haciendo hormigón? No para mí, pero durante mucho tiempo has estado haciendo hormigón. ¿Cuánto tiempo? Mm, 10 años. Uh, would you like to go swimming in my swimming pool? Oh, the other day. Did your... Uh, daughters come and swim in the pool? Te gustaría ir a nadar a mi piscina. O, oh, el otro día, tus hijas. Tus hijas vinieron a nadar a la piscina. Vino una nomás. Just one came. Ah, okay. Well, thank you very much for helping me uh, with my new toy. Muchas gracias por ayudarme con mi nuevo juguete. De nada. <laughs> you are welcome. Perfect. That conversation took place with the offline translation file. You can download several different language combinations into the Fluent Talk translator. And then you don't need a Wi Fi signal or a cell phone signal or anything. We could have been having that conversation out in the mountains where there's no signals whatsoever. Um, just another feature that. Um, Seems like a really good deal to me. This next segment is a conversation with my maid, but in the very beginning, she is stage struck looking at the camera. Just, I find it funny. I have a new translator. Will you help me make a little video for YouTube? Tengo un nuevo traductor. Me ayudarás a hacer un pequeño video para YouTube. Sí. Sí te ayudo a hacer un video. Okay, so we just have a little conversation. How long have you been working as a maid? Bien, solo llevo dos 
Solo tengan una pequeña conversación. ¿Cuánto tiempo llevas trabajando como empleada doméstica? Uh, como tres años. Sí. Like three years. You've been working for me for three years, but you've been working for other people for much longer, yes? Llevas tres años trabajando para mí, pero llevas mucho más tiempo trabajando para otras personas, sí. 15 años, 16 años. Uh -huh. 15 years, 16 years. So, do you want to tell me what your husband does? ¿Quieres decirme a qué se dedica tu marido? Es herrero. Hace puertas, ventanas, barandales, um, ¿cómo se llaman? Este, jabanes, muchas cosas. Escaleras. Um, ¿Qué más? Sí, no me acuerdo más. ¿Es un blacksmith? ¿Does he make doors, windows, railings? What are they called? This one has many things. Stairs. What else? What else is that he made all of the windows in my house here, right? Many years ago, 2011. ¿Qué otra cosa es eso? Hizo todas las ventanas de mi casa aquí, ¿verdad? Sí. Sí, hace sí hizo todas las ventanas, todas las cosas aquí de Jerry. And we do did all the windows. All the things here from yesterday today. And he did the doors, and he also welded the beams in the ceiling. Y él hizo las puertas, y también soldó las vigas en el techo. Y también le hizo una escalera muy bonita. And he also made a very nice staircase for him. Yes, that is true. Sí, eso es cierto. Uh, thank you very much for helping me make a video. Do you think that it's translating correctly? Muchas gracias por ayudarme a hacer un video. ¿Crees que se está traduciendo correctamente? Sí, está bien, correctamente. Uh -huh. Entiendo muy bien. Yes, it's okay, right. I understand very well. Muchas gracias. Muchas gracias. <laughs> Let's try out the text reader with a receipt I have from a vegetable market down the street. Uh, it says that I bought uva, plantano, pepinillo, jitomate, ceruela, naranja, and durazno. Now, I'm going to uh, touch the button for translating with the Fluent Talk T1 Mini. Here we go. It says that I bought grapes, bananas, pickles, tomatoes, plums, oranges, and peaches. Championes, mushrooms. Tuna and water. I definitely see using this at the grocery store to read uh, labels and ingredients lists and maybe cooking directions when I get something packaged at home. Fluent Talk, T1 Mini by Time Kettle. Uh, up and down volume buttons here on this side. Power button on the top. Speaker on the top. A microphone. One button Push to talk, release to translate. Push to talk, release to translate. Easy peasy. It has a very nice menu system. One of them that I particularly like is this. It calculates storage space for you. And it stores your conversations. So if somebody gave you directions, you could go back and check and see what they are. Wi-Fi. Airplane mode, settings, um, oh, volume and brightness, and a user guide built in. Display of their website URL, their email address for 
uh, customer support and their United States telephone number right there on the display. You can put in shortcut statements like things you might say often like, where's the bathroom? And of course, all of the menus and screens that you see can be uh, programmed to be in whatever language is your native language. For me, it's English. For you, it's whatever is your native language. All in all, it's very customizable to make it work the way you want it to work. But besides that, it just feels good in my hand. Discount codes below. My new translator will be right here in my pocket every time I leave home. You should get yours and don't leave home without it. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.